Greetings all over in this world. We are the Quest Bros bringing you the Gauntlet. Yes. Uh, as the Man name, still learning to snap. The opposite yes, of what the better. name suggests. This isn't just a long hallway of traps and boss fights and whatever. Because that's usually what a gauntlet is. Yep. This <laughs> is uh, this is Achieving about actual... this is about the artifact, oh. the Infinity Gauntlet. Just kidding. It's Man, just snapped. <laughs> it's just an. He has an actual good snap, too. Mr. Stark, I don't feel so good. <laughs> That's we so made that suck. I can't do it. We, we it was made... a fluke. <laughs> and we're ready. Yes, alright, so. But it's so, recorded. So. Last time we left off, the adventurers... We teleported back got to... Got fucked! Uh, like, straight up, just destroyed. Just <laughs> kidding, they just lost a lot of their shit. And had to go and buy wishes to restore... Tirelli back to his state of uh of power. <laughs> but power. 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 And I cannot be further disappointed. I got a blink ability that I can use three times a day. Instantaneously teleport to anywhere. Power! Else. And I learned how and I learned teleportation or how teleportation works. We barely made a dent in this money. That's good. Damn. Yeah. So how does so, it work exactly? Do we just? I. Oh. Okay, we're here. Jared, quoting himself. It's <laughs> <laughs> All right. Don't um, judge. Let's continue the journey to what so the place was called. Alderwig. Alderwig. Alderwin. 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 Dova cool. No, I actually right, started so, something. Yeah, yeah. Oh. Let's. Dova, can D20. we fix it? Dova, yes, we can. No, stop. So. <laughs> get some help. Mean trick, wait. You guys appeared a mile away from the keep. Um, you don't really know which direction to go until the gauntlet says. To go down. Sentinel. Oh, sorry, the Sentinel, yes. Oh, the, says, the gauntlet's here, no! Ah! Sentinel tells Touch. you to go down Alderway, to Alderway by going right. So you get back on the path and go right. You mean east? E! Or he just tells you, like. Oh, he tells me right. Yes. Okay, let's go right, guys. Okay, I'm gonna just follow him since he knows where he's going. And as you, as your army of everything. Of Neanderthal. Rounds the bend in the pass, a daunting fortress comes into view. Its lofty bulk um, clings grimly. You have structural weakness. I sent Wazer a roof on this place. No shit. Yes, there is. Okay, I didn't. I'm thinking it of clings like to a steep-sided mountain spur. Eagle. On the east side of the passage. <laughs> a car. I you send the eagle. <laughs> you send your eagle out to recon. The, the at this point, the sentinel asks you, he says, my most noble friend, there stands the keep of Alderwig. In defense of its walls, a garrison of a hundred men might destroy an army of thousands. But it was my purpose to defend the keep against the one force it could not withstand, the sorcerer's wrath of the gauntlet. But it seems that I have failed in this purpose, for I sense the gauntlet deep in the keep, and is firmly installed within the walls. Yet the keep still stands, and while it does, we may yet recapture it and destroy the gauntlet. Okay. The keep is no doubt well, well garrisoned, and, and to attack it openly would be an invite to a quick death. There is a better way. Since my power includes that of opening the magical locked gates of the keep, if you follow the trek, you are likely to come uh, to the key to a fork in the road. Take the rightmost fork, and this will lead you to the lower gates of the keep. These will open at the touch of the one who bears me, and beyond are chambers where you will find a stairway leading up into the heart of the keep. The creature who bears the gauntlet lurks high in the towers. Seek him out, and my destiny will be fulfilled. 
Ignore the path which runs upwards towards the um, track towards the keep's upper gates, since this will surely be well guarded, and not even my powers will open the gate for you. Make haste, for who knows what evil has been brought here, even now. From this point onwards, I must remain silent. Though my other powers will remain available to you, I dare not speak into your minds for fear that the gauntlet will sense my coming. May good fortune go with you. Shut up, man. Question. And also with you. What else? <laughs> <laughs> Does the door have to open on a touch, or can I like snap or clap or something? It touch. <laughs> you have yeah. to. Open you can door. pretend to open this. <laughs> clap. Open off. sesame. Clap, clap off. <laughs> the clapper. Okay, let's go as follows. All right. So he said there's like going north. There's one that's heavily guarded that we shouldn't go to. Yes. Okay, let's okay. go that way. No. Not everything is going to be an animal that you could just range your brother. Well, it was following the path. Although, the that would be very helpful. So yes, when you follow the path, you do come to a fork. Or take the right path. And then, um, beyond the fork comes a fork in the road. Oh. What is it with all these oh. forks? Um, can I pick the fork up at least? <laughs> no, I mean, I'm kidding. <laughs> I, w I didn't know if he was making another, like there's another fork in the road, or there's an actual edible fork. Not an <laughs> eating fork. Okay, because I was going to make an eating fork. You pick, up, you, you pick up the fork. It too is a magical item. Oh, fuck! <laughs> but if, if you found it's cursed, it. cursed. You cannot let it go anymore. It is my, my only weapon. <laughs> <laughs> Anyways, you come to the fork in the road, and you take the right. rightmost. Right. To head towards the lower gates. At this point, you you go down to the lower gates of the keep. On the western side of the fortress, the wall which looms up from the track to the battlement battlemented area has two large tower-like buttresses. As you round the first of these, you find an impressive gateway occupying most of it, the width of the wall. Cool. Can I detect evil? Looking at the windows of the battlements or something? Nope. There's no evil. Cool, let's go up and, and touch the door. Why are you touching me? <laughs> it's the I'm gate. not the door. <laughs> Is it sure? Um, you open... Yes. The gateway opens. We've <laughs> woken the hive. None of you will get it, but I do. <laughs> That's what matters. Somebody in the comments will get it. I hope someone of you watching this will get it. Nobody got it that day. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> sad. Alright, what do we see? Everything. No. Um, you come into oh God! You come, in, us. you come into a large, impressive room. The walls and ceilings are of a deep red, lustrous stone flecked with glitter, glittering white I inclusions. The floor is of a smooth, pale green or pale gray stone, and has a large coat of arms inlaid in the center. In an alcove. In each of the corners of the room is a large stone chair. Three of these chairs are occupied by strange, silent, unmoving figures, which appear to be no more than just the suits of human-sized clothing arranged as if they are worn by an invisible, seated man. The chair in the southeast alcove is empty. Um, there is a door to evil. the north and a door to the east. Detect evil. Nope. Detect magic. No. Well, mm, yeah, mm, maybe. Uh, <laughs> yeah. Um, da, da, da. I have a bad feeling. No. This. Nothing? No. Um, Are you sure about that? Are you sure about that? Okay. Are you sure, sure about that? Oh, actually, Aha. he glows. Oh, <laughs> Wait, wouldn't I also Fuck glow? You. Since I yes. We all glow. glow. It's, there you we, go. We all, Fuck you. We all glow <laughs> down here. Um, I go to investigate one of the mysterious figures in the chair. Um, okay, it looks exactly like what I said. I, like, stick my hand through it to see if something is there. Your hand it disappears. There. Oh, no! You are now one-armed Willy. Um, no. Yeah. You, I mean, you can. You just go through it. So, they're just um, kind of floating there, then. But only three of the four chairs are occupied. Uh -huh. Okay, can somebody who knows magic under, uh, explain what the hell that is? Yes. Riley? Yeah, Riley. Do you know what the fuck's going on, Riley? He goes, yes, Riley, and looks behind himself. He goes, oh, that's right. I'm Riley. <laughs> <laughs> you okay? <laughs> that's, 
how to get good intelligence. <laughs> He's joking. Oh, uh, yes. Oh yeah, because we forgot to ask him if he wanted a wish. Yeah. Forever salty. He's fucking loaded. Whatever. Forever salty. <laughs> he said he didn't want one. He said he didn't need one. He never said he didn't want one. You're oh. giving out free wishes. I'll give a wish. Okay. Your sass aside. <laughs> What's going on? Yes. These are the guardians of the Keep of Alderwig. They are invisible-ish creatures that will guard and protect the Keep. If we do not touch them or mess with them, we will be fine. Just the equipment and stuff. We don't need to start taking it or anything. They'll be fine. They won't attack us. Why are there only... Why is the fourth one? Do you have any idea? Are you... I'm asking right. I don't know if there was a fourth one. Uh, what happens if we sit in the fourth chair? Don't. Nothing. Oh, okay. Yeah. Also, he, he'll sit down and say, nothing happened. And then another three attack. No. <laughs> I was going to say, it's like, if we don't mess with him, we're fine. Meanwhile, Bunyan Paulson has, like, his hand just Bunyan in his no. face. Bunyan, no. Yes. <laughs> Bun Bunyan what? Uh, but no. Let's go okay. east. Side. East, okay. Um, go east. 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 You walk into a small plain room. Projecting from the left hand wall is a long stone table with a pan balance mounted on it near the right hand end. Behind the table are a pair of chairs and a large iron bounded chest against the far wall. As you walk in and you identify the room, you can hear Riley say that this is the toll room. Alderweg would have many adventures coming through because this is one of the only ways to get through the Mount, um, Camp Mountain, which is the name of the mountain region south. Hmm. He says, so we would collect tolls coming on through here. Um, I see. Smash the chest. Open the chest. Yeah. Fine. See if the chest can open and then maybe smash. Fine. <laughs> um... <laughs> What does this chest look like? I'm part car I, I'm a carpenter by trade. What is this uh cra what is the craftsmanship of this chest? This poor smash it. I am bounded. Fuck, this what? is out of my this is out of my <laughs> jurisdiction. Okay, so the chest is you can open it. Um Creek. It does have three locks, but none of which are locked, and when you open it it is empty. Uh, smash it. Take the locks. Why no, it's has three locks. The locks so are it's a three locked chest. Okay. I'll smash the chest. Why? Why? Why not? Okay. Nothing's in there. I'm not Roll. doing any harm. The chest was a mimic. So Surprise! Damn it. <laughs> damn it. You <laughs> smash. <laughs> you smash it. I wanted him to fail too. Don't worry. You grab it. You throw it against the wall. It bounces off the wall, chipping away, and you drop kick it into the wall. <laughs> <laughs> And it just shatters against the wall. That seemed like an unnecessary <laughs> use of force. I just um being safe. I'm being safe and I'm intimidating it and I can't we can't see. He says it's a thing. Do you just have a up. thing against furniture of all kind? Yeah. He can, we got XP last time because we destroyed a bunch of extra stuff. <laughs> so, yeah. yeah. <laughs> you you guys saying that, you look over and Riley's just like <laughs> I don't, Puzzled and like, oh. doesn't know what's going on. I don't get it either. I'm a I'm a, I'm a carpenter, so you know this is kind of cringy for me. So if we ever get a when we go back to the place and I build a uh, workshop, you're not allowed in it. I like Link when it comes to furniture. Like, <laughs> is this a pot? <laughs> Yeet! <laughs> oh, sir, sure. Boom! Yeah, you're not allowed in the uh, carpenter's workshop once we get one. I can blink. I can go in there anytime I want. That scares me. <laughs> blink. Wait, why are you in here? Grow. <laughs> Bunyan! <laughs> blink again. <laughs> Shrink. Blink three more times. <laughs> why did you get three more? Because it's the. It, I did it at 12 o'clock. <laughs> <laughs> so I could get away from her. I swear to God! <laughs> All right, so that's and that's the end of this room. All righty. Well, let's head. You said there was another door. This yep, to the north. To the north. All right, let's let's uh, Back out and go through that door. That's mosey on there, yeah. All right, so you start to head north. 
this whole room is completely worthless because of somebody. <laughs> but <laughs> I'm not gonna say who, Anthony. But <laughs> I mean, just because there's animals. <laughs> so yes. how do we fit all the animals in here anyway? I mean, they're just a line. We're like a giant naga just slithering <laughs> through this cave. We're, we're a naga of death. <laughs> just like oh it, 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 I, it. I just like to think that Dan would be like, all right, you went to a room with all the animal, oh, a bunch of animals. Anthony, you just get all the animals. <laughs> <laughs> it's like Anthony, you went to a room full of animals. And you're just like, just like watching. <laughs> <laughs> I, I like that idea that Anthony just goes, I go, okay, you walk into a long hall, and appearing before you is an, ar like, a small army, like, like, five to twenty, um, giant worker ants, and Anthony just goes, ah, and I go, now you have all of them. <laughs> <laughs> which is um, now the small up. army, which is now yours. <laughs> But no, you walk into a long hallway which has this, like, do you guys know what waxing paper is? Yeah. Yes. That's basically what's covering the hallway in oh. three sections, but it's sticky and gross. So, so like you, fly paper? Yeah. So you go through it and you see just five giant working ants. Worker ants. Oh. You... you. <laughs> Uh, they're not hostile right now because we didn't do anything yet, so it automatically works. <laughs> so you just shh, ranger, ranger. I uh, ask the ants what the fuck is on the wall. Ant, what's on the wall? Um, please don't say it's like food. It's just like mucus membranes and stuff. It's just like what they leave behind. Oh, okay. So you tell them to not. <laughs> it, it uneven screen of a paper-like material. Can you not? Um, can you not? Ants, what are you doing here? What is your purpose here? Oh, what is your purpose? They tell you about a little tunnel that they dug from underground, and they've dug up into this room, and they're just expanding their colony. Tell them to not. Um, well, they work for us. Do now. You, have you ran into any suspicious activity or harm or anything of that sort? No. Um, do you have any information about this, what, what is this place called? Alderwig? Alderwig, yeah, like, like what type of place? A keep? The forge, keep? The keep? Anything no, about this keep? they don't know. Okay. They have, they don't know anything beyond this room. Can you tell them to, tell except, the rest of their colony to stay out of the keep? Except that room in which you came from, and any of those that went in there would soon meet a terrible fate, because, um, these... Three large, invisible um, creatures attacked us. They attacked the ants. Yeah. Oh. So why did they attack you guys? They don't know. Um, Riley. Riley says, "Isn't that kind of obvious, though? They're intruders." Oh. I mean, so are we, but you know. But you have the sentinel. Have the sentinel so oh, they, that's right. Yeah. So we didn't like bust in. We were granted access. You actually access. granted access. Yeah. Plus. We just knocked on the. Riley's. The. T technically the owner of the keep. Oh, yeah. Okay. Remember, he comes from the yeah. line that the family of mages that... Oh, yeah, totally and you just broke his freaking tax chest. Thanks. That's why he was like, what? Why? I'll build you a new one. No, you don't need to worry about it. Okay, never mind. Tell the ants to just... Nah, ants don't because <laughs> you're... You're getting attacked because you're invading this sacred fortress. Sacred? I don't know if the sacred is the right word. So... Stay out of the fortress, they'll be fine. Yeah. I mean, if you if you would like to uh, not get yeah. harmed. They crawl they just start crawling back down their hole then. Unless you want to join us. I mean they'll join you if you want them to. <laughs> they crawl back out of the hole. How, how many of them are there? Five. 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 That's the one. There's eight, nine more in the next room. Cause remember there's three sections of this hallway. <laughs> okay, um where are your strongest ally allies ants? Alright. <laughs> Carry on. As Would you not. walk through the next... I'm just gonna step over the music. Oh, space. by the way, hanging from the ceiling are the ants' food store stores. So you can see, like, one contains a lamb, one contains a rabbit, one contains a giant lizard, one contains a giant fire beetle. 
fun. A ranger that's all glowing. No, they're dead. They're all dead. It's glowing. Fire beetles in here are giant beetles in which glow red and they're hot. Oh, they're not, like, not magic glow. They're like fire. Okay. Yeah. Um, they spit hot fire. They. Spit I think. The I clip. think they actually spit fire. Oh nice. fuck. So, um, but yeah, no. So then there's just a bunch of bundles of food above you. I have to let them know if it's theirs. Yeah, um, and then I'm just gonna the, step in the, the next paper. room, you see a queen ant sitting on an altar-like table. And beyond the queen ant of her bloated mass, it actually says that, Gross. Oh um, you see a vivid mosaic of the sentinel. I don't know why the ants made this, or if they didn't, and the people of Alderway did, but it's just there. It looks like it was made there. But maybe I'll, the I'll ants just know. For that. I just sneeze and rage the animals. <laughs> oh, no, the uh, worker, or not the worker, the soldier ants are instantly hostile, so they actually get a save. Oh, okay. goddamn. And it fails. <laughs> Okay. I don't know where my other d20 went. Can you use my d20? <laughs> my, jump, my jumbo your, d20. Your jumbo die. Two failed to save. Oh. Boy. Turn on your allies. Um, tell your your aunt fellows that we mean no harm. Your aunt brothers. Or sisters. It's kind of hard to tell. Um, alright. The queen ant tells them not to attack you because you said you rangered them. I only said the worker ants attacked you. I didn't say the queen ant did it. Oh, did I ranger the queen? Oh, <laughs> you said you rangered all of them. Oh, yeah, okay. Yeah. So, so that works. Yeah. <laughs> wait, I did that? <laughs> Shut up, oh, wait, you're right, I did. <laughs> Just roll with it. So, yes, <laughs> okay. the queen ant tells them not to attack you, and they don't attack. Okay. Um, we mean no harm, ants. Um, did you... Ants, did you make this, this shrine? No, they didn't. No. Um, do you, does the shrine mean anything to you? No, it doesn't. Ask okay. them it, uh... Fuck, I don't know what to Have you been attacked by the ghost no. creatures? Ghost creatures? The good things that were outside. In the other room. Oh. No, they haven't. They don't come into this room. Okay. Um, have you seen anyone else? Are you just colonizing here? Yeah. Can you tell them to not? Don't, because or else you get attacked. Uh, she can. She is currently pregnant and cannot move. Gross. Well, when you're done, her, tell her to move. move. When you're done being pregnant, you want to set camp somewhere else. It'd be more beneficial for your your kind, your species, your species, your camp, All right. whatever. Um. Okay. Yes. So, yeah, let's go. they got that. Okay. Yeah. As soon as, uh, as soon as uh, the word pregnant comes up, I just look at uh, Bunny and Paulson and just mouth the words, don't. Because oh, <laughs> yeah. last time something had babies, you killed it. Okay. Yeah, I just, I just shake my head and go, don't. Um, <laughs> I won't. Okay, let's continue on. I would Do like it's... to request two ant followers, oh, okay. if she so pleases to. She can decline me though, if she needs um, them. Um. The four soldiers she would like to keep to say protect her, um, but since we can't colonize here, she's free to give you two of her worker ants. Nice. Um, so the other six can continue to build underneath the keep and build outwards. We'll take it. Yeah. All right. I'm just imagining these things look like uh, the giant ant from Ant uh, Ant Man. Yeah. Have you ever played um, Fallout Three? No. Yeah. Uh, giant ants in there. That that's these. Nice. So like, and there are giant like fire ants that assholes. Are we talking like a greyhound sized ant or? Yeah. Oh okay. Yeah. We're that's... Talking like this table sized ant. Nice. Oh. So we could. You know what? The ant in Ant Man Two is a good description yeah. of oh, what okay. these things look like. Yeah, like the one they have like as a pet. Yeah. That's, that is these. He has two of them. Nice. Um, um, but they're worker ants. Their hit die is two, so they have 16 hit points. And they only have one attack, pinch, and it does a d6. So then, in this third little hallway here, actually, if we go back, there's a door oh. in the other room. The door. 
room? Well, in the second part of this hallway, there's three parts. Yeah. In the second part, there's a door. The one with the queen? Nope, the one with the first five were grants. There was a door in there? Yes, I didn't say it because... We were so hell-bent we on We were so hell-bent on figuring out oh. why the ants were colonizing here. Yeah, let's go back and check out that door. She's Purgant? 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 She have starch masks? <laughs> <That's>, uh, <laughs> she did. Uh, Alright, so you guys walk through a hallway, and then you walk into, or then you come to a door. Um, open the door? Slowly. <laughs> Carefully. Open Help. the door with you caution. You open this room. With Hello. caution. With caution. Hello? Hello? <laughs> you open this room with caution. This octagonal room has a slender stone pillar near the wall. At each corner, the ceiling is painted to represent a domed roof. Supported by these pillars and the walls, show a co country scene with continue, which continues in all way around the room. Um, with a little imagination, one, you could be standing in a summer home surrounded by pleasant pa pastures and woodlands at the top of a grassy slope leading down to a large lake. Uh, Lovely. Can I see any life in the lake? <clears throat> with my ability. Are you going to freaking ranger the fish? No, the tech you all. Alright, let, <laughs> let me say this again. You're in an octagonal room. Got it. Which the ceiling is painted to represent the domed roof supported by the pillars that are around you. With a little imagination, oh. you could be standing in a summer home surrounded by pleasant pastures and woodlands at the top of a grassy slope that leads down to a lake. So that's our imagination. It's a painting. Okay. You're standing in a room which all the walls so and roof and the floor is painted to look like you're in a it makes it sound more like you're in a gazebo oh. and you're looking around, but it says a summer home. I think it describes it more as a gazebo. Yeah, that makes yeah. more sense. It does. Riley, so, what the fuck? Uh no clue. Straight up he can tell you a little bit about this history. He says like um this room was decorated by Carl von Arthog, Arthog, um, which was one of the which was the la the last guardian of Burgoff to remind him of his home, a lakeside villa, which is where you guys got the sentinel. Oh, um, he says that this room was the last thing Carl talked about. Or not talked about was the last thing he kind of did in this place. No clue what this room means. No clue why he did this. I think he's fucking insane. <sighs> I, um, can we walk through any of the paintings? <laughs> like in Super Mario. Yeah. Are, are you just gonna like run up to the walls and start brushing your hands? I touch all the walls. <laughs> <laughs> did we close the door? On, we. I'm guessing we did. What? Or are we just leaving all the doors open? I'm kind of leaving. Yeah. Alright, so we left this open. Oh, good. Um, does that matter? Yes, it does. Okay. Well, better game. <laughs> Oops. Well, too late now. Um, but you. Here, it doesn't matter. It won't. The reason why I said it now is because with what he's going to do, it's not going to matter. Oh. So you brush your hand against the walls. Oh, if I run into the wall, the door. You're brushing your hand against the walls, and you find something. When you open it, it's a door. And you open up another door. Oh. Is that the only door? You're going to continue? Yeah. And you do it again, door. and you find another one. Keep doing it until I circle all the no. walls. So you circle all the walls, and you don't find any more. Okay, so so you, think, you know that these are the only three doors. What about the ceiling? You do have a spider. Uh, you... I get on my spider. <laughs> get on your spider and rub against the ceiling, and there's nothing up there. Okay. Hmm. Um, I could also, you know, just touch I, it. I could do it. I feel yeah. like you're... Oh, yeah. Okay, so now we have two doors to go through. Yep. Split the party! No! Wait. I mean, we have a fucking army, so... Well, one door is kind of easier to just explain what's in it than the other one. Because the other one's a room, and there's three doors. The one you came from, this one, 
This one goes up into a staircase, mm -hmm. and then the other one's a room. Okay, so let's check the room. Uh, yeah. Yeah. There you go. Knock, knock. There you go. Knock, there you go. Get the door. It's religion. So you come into a room, which is circular, and it seems to be unoccupied, with the exception of a circular area in the center of the room. And, wait, hold on. This room also confused me when I read it the first time, so I'm going to do it slower. Just This room is a circular and seems to be unoccupied. Yes, it actually yeah. says is a cir is circular and seems to be unoccupied. With in the, the exception corner. of a circular area in the center of the room, or in the center of the wall, floor walls, floor and ceiling are of a smooth pale gray stone. The circular area contains a stark spiral pattern in black and white. So, so it's describing in the everything in this room is gray stone except a circle in the middle of the room which is a spiral pattern of black and white tiles so it's like that i don't know why they couldn't say that they had to go through and say everything in this room is the same except for circular and then the floor walls and whatever like yeah, i don't know why they said that yeah. yeah so it, it's like one of those hypnotism yes but it's on the floor yeah. in the center of the room Riley, the fuck <laughs> <laughs> Riley, what the fuck? <laughs> um, he doesn't know much except that this room only became significant during the siege of Alderwick. He says, I don't even really know the great details of what happened during this, um, or I don't even know the great details of what happened during when Alderwick got attacked, but, um, I, he's like, I don't know. This was much more of Carl, Carl, Carol, whatever, Cole? his, his stuff. And I don't know what the significance of this room is or the last room. He sounds like an eccentric. Use to detect magic. What does that mean? Basically, very, he has a lot of money and he doesn't know what to do with it. So he wastes it on crazy stuff. Carl? Yes. No, I don't think he was that. He didn't really waste his money. So over this room had like a important purpose, but you don't know what it is. Or Tender Riley. I feel yes. I feel like it had an important purpose, and I don't know what it is of a now. Detect magic. Nothing. Okay. Um, I go stand on the circle. Got it. Area. Nothing. No, nothing. Follow the spiral around. <laughs> nothing. Follow the yellow per crow. Yeah, he starts getting shorter and shorter as he walks down the spiral. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Imagine if Riley didn't know you were like could do that. He's like, oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. What the fuck? He goes to do it. He's like, wait, why isn't it working? <laughs> <laughs> How'd you... Where'd he go? You're basically Ant-Man. I am, actually. Or am I. <laughs> Yet. Fuck. Wait! <laughs> Stop! No! Anthony, give me your ass! <laughs> I'm so confused. He, Riley feels bad. He says he's sorry because he feels like he's like not helping much. He he just he knows a lot about the place. He knows like if we go up those stairs that they take us to the second floor, but he just doesn't know like this undercroft croft he doesn't know anything about. Okay. Mm. To touch all the walls, okay. touch the ceiling. Nothing. Nothing, okay, so nothing. This room has no purpose, okay, got well, it. Now we have two options. We can go back to the room with the queen and keep going down that hallway with both the stairs. No, the hallway ended with her the on queen. the... Oh, is it? Yeah, with the queen. So, oh, up, the up the stairs. Then. All right. Um, so the stairs take you to the second floor, but they keep going up. So you can keep going up the stairs or you can get off on the second floor. Second floor. Second floor. Second floor. Second floor. Okay. I have to explore every inch of this place. Yeah, that's how. That's why. That's how we do it. Yeah. <laughs> that way, once Riley. It's like a get, video game. Like you don't yeah. leave any room unchecked. Exactly. Yeah. That way, once Riley gets it back, well, <laughs> it's all checked and cleared for him. Exactly. The air in this room is filled with a strong smell of sweet, and the sound of a of non too gentle Wait, snoring. Sweat. You're doing sweat. Not sweet. Uh, I don't. It probably is sweat. But spell the sweet. How do you spell sweat? S W E A T. Okay, it is sweat. <laughs> <laughs> um, I also don't understand why they say that. They should say 
the air of this room has a strong smell of booze and the sound of non too gentle snoring. Um, much of the floor is covered with straw on the which half a dozen humanoids wearing leather armor, one of them clutching a flagon. You can see six gnolls lying on the ground. Ah, these bastards. Kentucky. Yeah. They're all going to be they're 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 evil. They're gnolls. They're gnolls. Yeah. They have to be evil. <laughs> well, what the fuck do we do here? I don't know. Is there like, last time I attacked one, I literally almost killed myself. Is there like another door in this room? Oh. Yeah. There's two doors. Nope, just one. I lied. That's the next floor. At the other end. There's one door at the end of the room. Is there any treasure in here? Outside of what's on these bodies, probably. Um, um outside of what's on them, uh, you can see maybe a, a small ivory bell amongst the, um, straw. Maybe a couple coins are scattered about under the straw. Okay, uh, everyone back out. <laughs> We gotta get to the, the door. I know. They are unarmed. Oh. Into this I didn't room. say oh. that. They all have battle axes. They're just asleep. Still. So we can attack them without consequence. Eh. Okay, no, I have an idea, guys. Wake okay. them up, wake them up at least. Yeah. See, no, I know. Yeah. Wake them up. Everyone, everyone back out of the hall. Okay. On it, I close so, the door and just I, like, I stand, stand away no, no, from no, it. No, 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 I'm standing in the doorway with the door, with my hand in the thing. I, um,. Should I do to make a lot of noise? You have something on you that you can just throw? Oh, I do. So I have oh, a tower shield. This I have is it. gonna be gruesome. <laughs> <laughs> I have a tower shield. I have an axe, right? <laughs> bang, 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 bang. <laughs> <laughs> they, they wake up. And wait, no, wait. You didn't. Chain lightning slam door closed. <laughs> oh no! I was <laughs> gonna. No, wait. You gotta make sure that they actually like start being hostile okay. and attack you. As soon, okay. I mean, they wake up pissed off, because no, even if you were a null, they'd probably beat the shit out of you yeah. for doing what you just did. So they will attack him. So they w We are not yeah. getting consequences. <laughs> we're learning. The best part is, though, as you start to close the door, you look to see on the right of you where the other door is. You see that open up, and in that room, you oh see God. 15 gnolls just charging in as you go like this, <laughs> pulling out your hand to chain lightning. It's high news. Shazam. And you shoot it in. You see your chain lightning bolt travel slowly, all in slow motion as the door starts to close. You see it hit the no leader in the chest. He goes over the other other knolls into the room. And the ones that were sleeping get up and they're like, what? And they just see this bolt of lightning which struck their, struck their leader, ricochet back <laughs> and strike someone else who was just getting up. And oh at that moment, I mean, what is it, an 18? Level 18. Oh my god. <laughs> is it worth rolling for? Um, Oh, I can Yeah, think. sure, watch this. Ready? Uh, dead, 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 dead. All we hear is just like a bunch of yells and like screams and curses, and it's just. So, Riley, how's your day going? Uh, t t fine. I. D <laughs> fuck! What was that? Oh, uh, you know. <laughs> Shh. Don't, 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 don't worry, worry about it. Yeah, What'd you do to that? Don't go in there! <laughs> do not open the door until it's safe! <laughs> We need a safe word for this, for this kind of thing. <laughs> Outside of Shazam, that's the activation one. <laughs> we need a safe word for when it's clear. Outside of you just opening the door and we s just no. Melt, so like, you the the thundering claps of just death. Stop. <laughs> um, you okay in there, buddy? <laughs> so all right. Fucking murder! Oh my god! <laughs> everyone! Oh god! Everyone is dead. Not all of them. There's like. 12 and 15, I can only kill like 18 of them. So it's still the, a lot. There was, a lot. there was a total of 21. So, so that's... there's only like 4 left. 3 left. And they're shitting themselves. <laughs> <laughs> they're sitting there like, okay, I woke up and everyone just died. I like to imagine one of them is in like a nighty with like the freaking cap, like night cap on their head and the teddy bear is just like, oh, I'm born again. What the fuck? So, you walk in. 
and you see, like, maybe five gnolls which tried to come into the room and head towards the door that died and are on the ground. You see the six ones that were sleeping roasted into the walls. Um, you see the leader hole through his chest, basically, in the other room. And as you start to walk into the other room, you see four, te four terrified gnolls, one in which has lightning scar because your oh, chain wow, lightning hit him and it didn't kill him. So his heart is racing and you see his eyes like bulging out of his head as oh, he's like shaking because he doesn't know what happened. <laughs> he literally like, because lightning travels fast. Yeah. He, he blinked and when he, every time he blinked, like four more of his friends were dead. And now he was the last one. He's thinking to himself, how, how did I live? Why did I live? I lived, bitch. Like, do I need to rethink my life? <laughs> like, I, I, I kind of knock on the door. And no, the other I three are just, like, terrified. Because you dropped eight, still 17 gnolls in literally probably uh, eight, 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 second. eight seconds Damn. max. And they're shaking. Battle at, or yeah, battle axes in hand, and just like just like when you yell at a dog for shitting on the carpet, they're shaking like that. <laughs> oh my God. I'm gonna make a bold move and open the door. Which what door? Uh, the you, one he already. We, we, we walked in. Oh, we walked in. And this oh, is what we like, see. Oh God. Um. Okay. Well. Put down your weapons. I put the cookie down. They drop their weapons. Cool. I didn't know that worked. Is a rope in the room? You, you see the one that, the last one that got hit, like, touching himself, looking at the mark, just like... Oh, cool, you survived. Hey, good on you. <laughs> <laughs> good on you, you survived! <laughs> what? <laughs> what? <laughs> what? <laughs> um, so they drop their weapons, and they're just like, they're shocked. Um... But at this time, you hear maybe other ones um, below you making stir. And then you think, you went from the basement to the second floor. What about the first floor? And when you look down, you see that there's a grate that goes, that is downstairs. Oh, shit. Oh. And you see, like, Knowles, like, scratching and can't get through some bars. Because the way to open that gate, oh, you look up and it's right next to the grate that you're looking down from. The wench to open it is right here. Oh, so they're <laughs> so trapped on the first floor. They're trapped on in, well, like I'm a, just going like to say, in a limbo. they're yeah. trapped on the balcony of the first floor. Nope, sorry. They're trapped in room 11 of the first floor, which is, because you can go downstairs and then there's where this room would be in the grate. There's that room, and then there's the room that they're in, and then there's the balcony. Um, Alright. Can you I try to convince them nothing happened? <laughs> <laughs> what? I have 21 charisma. I'm going to drink him a Sure. Shot. Sure. I, I'll go for it. Do you it. know Noel? So you're just going to say it in common. I was going to say it in common. Got it. Okay. Good luck with that. Good luck with that. 17. Yeah. They just are barking. <laughs> Or a hyena barking. Um, open the gate. No. Why? Open the no, gate. Don't open the gate. There's two wenches, so there's two gates. How many? So there's actually here. Let me explain this. Wait, wenches? Bit. Can you just like show? Don't oh, wench. No. Yeah, winch. I thought, I thought winch. I thought, I thought, winch. I'm thinking those are the creatures. No, that's the no. Thing. Those okay. are the things that open the gates. The creatures in there are the ones oh, we just killed. The, yeah, the gnolls. The gnolls. Okay. The portcullis. Yes. Yes. Okay. There's two of those. One on each side of this, like, giant grate on the floor. And then, actually, the other thing in this room is, like, a thing of hot oil that would could be, like, dumped. Ignited. Oh, okay. And, yeah, and then ignited. I know. Wait, it's the, bal no, no, the balcony's no, no, outside, I... right? Yes. But you can't get to the balcony from this room. Um, but this room does curl around, and then there's a staircase... The bottom of the staircase, there's bars, which the second part. Are they wearing metal us. armor? Huh? Are they wearing metal armor? Them? No. Yeah. They're, They're wearing, wearing leather. leather. 
In Breath of the Wild, if you have a metal weapon, it still like attracts the lightning, right? Yeah. Yes. Thunderstorm. But aren't they like really bad thunderstorm? But aren't they like defenseless because they can't do anything? No, they're they're, they're, they're like, not even outside. They're not. No. No. Oh, I thought they were outside. It, it no, there's, there's, outside. There's, there's, there's there's here's the room where the grate shows. That's the room they're in. That's the balcony. Oh. They're like between that. Yeah. So. So no. I don't like. Retract. Can I like? Do we have like any like? I know we don't we're not proficient spears, but can we like poke at them a little bit or something? I mean, can we not? They're a floor down. They're a floor down. Are You'd they, have to be as I, tall as you so you could just stab their heads. That's fair. Um. Okay. Well, well is, is there any failing? Well, not as but, tall as. Can we just react? You could, yes. There's yeah. no way for them to do anything. Well, yeah. except for these four. Yeah, but, who are pissing their pants. Okay. Is there rope in the room? I was going to say, you four, yeah, get the sure. fuck out of here. Yeah, no, sure. Okay, we'll, we'll tie them up with the rope. Okay, you tie them up in the rope and kick them in the corner. I don't, don't kick them in the corner. Oh, I'll kick them in the corner. <laughs> Riley, Riley will, will kick them in the corner. Ah, get in the corner. What alignment is Riley Ow. again? Uh, chaotic evil. Neutral. I was gonna say, like, true, neutral or yeah, true neutral. True okay. neutral. Okay. okay. I mean, this is his house technically, so he has every. He sort of has right. Okay. So get in the corner, you bloody. So what else? Dog. Can, what else can we do? I was gonna say ape, but then I was like, they're not apes. Where did you get a gun? <laughs> Man, a gun. What, what else can we do? Like, what else is in? This um. Room? Okay. So the other thing in this room is in just another door. Ooh. Where does that door go? Uh, it goes into like, okay, that door opens up, and then this is like the upper area of where the gaunt or sentinel told you not to go. This is the front gate oh. of this place. So that's why I was heavily guarded. I murdered all of them. Well, sort of. I'm gonna go see what they there's had. There's more. Uh, the first, first floor, and probably third floor too. I'm um, assuming. then there's a little alcove, which is like the balcony. No, there. It's a uh, like the guard station for oh. the gate. There's that, and then there's another door, which opens up into a stable, which has a shadow horse on it that we can call Nightmare. It has a nightmare! shadow horse. Nightmare! Nope. Oh. No shadow horse. I dropped my dice. That sucks. Oh. Anyways, I'm um, seated. Nope, not this. This is a stable. With five stalls against the eastern walls, three of these contain horses, which whining, whine, whining plentifully when Whin they see you. Whinnying? Whine, whine, w h i n n y. Whinnying. What is that? It's the noise. Whinnying? horse. <laughs> yeah, basically. It's okay. The, it's the horse noise. They look underfed and undergroomed. Ugh. Voice crack. And the room smells as if. The stalls have not been cleaned in many days. Gross. So they're, they're just horses, right? Nothing. They're evil very about them. Can I detect evil, evil horses. <laughs> so you, you start going through. What level are you? Uh, three. Three. Really? Yeah. Oh. Level three. Ah, it's gonna come one one level sh sooner. That's okay. You start going through. And you're like, you're fine. You're or you're not evil. You're not evil. And you come to one. And you go, you just, you stand there. And you look at it. And you have that whole, like... Oh, is this my dun, war horse? Dun, 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 dun. Dun, 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 dun. <laughs> dun, dun. Kind of thing like Link has uh -huh. when he's, like, recollecting memories. Yeah. But you have that moment with this horse. This is going to be my paladin's war yeah. horse. And the oh. horse... <laughs> <laughs> Neat. That's it. Keeps going through. Neat. You're good. Go stay with the other horses. I mean, he's still in the stall. Okay, let him out, and Anthony, can you tell him to go stay with the other Ranger, horses? Ranger, your horse. <laughs> 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 Just, um, Mr. Steal your horse right over here. I open, we have open all of them. So, um, you let loose the when you horses guys let it out, it looks way too small for you, right? Until a divine thunder comes down, and in a blinding flash of light, this horse grows about two and a half times its size to fit your small 
form. Just to fit your, fit your small form. Okay. But it also gets us a very familiar looking, like, oh, neck tablet. chain. Oh. <laughs> it armors up, and lightning streaks through its body as it gains greenish hair, a lot like uh, storm giants usually have. That's... You awakened its potential. That is freaking epic. <laughs> Damn, you lost it! Why'd you let him do that? You the horse, another divine strike comes down, and it stands up, gains hands, and takes a bow. <laughs> no. So it has mounted crossbows. Can he talk to the horse? Yes, okay. I'm pretty sure. Are I don't know how, horse, how paladin's horses work. How does one? I just know it's food? special and strong. Yeah. Alright, so I guess like a D8 attack. Or I'm something. imagining a Clydesdale, but bigger. Because it's a heavy <coughs> yeah. war horse. Like yeah. Yeah. Horse. It's a heavy yeah. war horse, but stronger um, than a heavy war horse. I a war horse. commanded to go wait by where we left the other horses. With the horses. With the, uh, let's take with a, the horses. With a thunder like neigh, it runs off. Neigh. And you <laughs> just hear like a lightning strike. Did you just get the flash of horses? Yeah. Yes. And. It sounded very devastating, like it just ran through the wall or something. <laughs> oh my so when God. you guys go to investigate, you see that the gate looks fine, actually. You sit here and you think about it for a second, and you see the horse in the distance, and it does it again. You just hear a very devastating crash. You realize when the horse gets to its max speed, it can sometimes just turn into lightning and shoot away. You, you have the flash of horses. So yeah. You, oh. Have you guys seen how big horses can be compared to people? Very. Yeah. This Very. thing's giant compared so to if it, So when it grows to fit my giant form, we're fucked. <laughs> Trojan man! <laughs> <laughs> you, would just, you would just rear up and just smash a freaking like, wall. I could basically be like the horse version of Godzilla wrecking every scene. <laughs> so now it'll be like, it's gonna take us, um, like, two days to get to town. Bitch, you guess Everyone get on the horse. <laughs> Every <laughs> step, we're there. <laughs> everyone on the horse. And you, wanted to, and you wanted to teleport. You wasted that way. <laughs> you I wanted to. I did. Like, I did this with my last party. I gave them all their special because I have two paladins in my other party. Mm -hmm. They have all special horses and stuff. Uh, I just like it's like the perfect time. It's like this is the perfect time to get it. You just like because you have to go on an adventure to get it anyways. Perfect time to give it to you. Okay. <laughs> in I mean, the I middle of this one. I'm a knight. I'm good even with almost all horses. Even if level early. Yeah, so. I did. It. One of my paladins was the level. The other one was a two level early, like you. I didn't care. I was like, dude, you're just, gonna get it anyway. Yeah. There you go, horse. <laughs> horse. Uh, Riley turns around and goes, I... Can you two do that? <laughs> like, are you two, like, god horses? What? What was that? Yeah. What did you just get? What happened? And I go, not with horses. <laughs> oh, my animals come back to me. <laughs> Honestly, I don't even know what happened. I think my hair is all staticky. Hold on. I take off my helmet. It's just... Uh, yeah, it's... Jared yeah. slowly starts to become himself in the game. <laughs> like my hair becomes like a fro. It's just okay. like... Let's right. head back to the room where we massacred everyone. Yeah, well, or you I, massacred. You did the massacre. Yeah. We had no part in that. I can't Put the use that again back on. for the rest of the day, though. So we have to nothing. Go. Nothing rests for this level. So off to the stairs yep. we went. Back up the stairs. And we come. We probably should have... And then we walk into the room. This room is filled with a smell of cooking meat. Ooh. Seated in a chair before a fire, at the western end of this room is an ancient female humanoid, wearing a filthy leather apron and holding a novel, nobbly staff. Detect evil. She, yes, she's a gnoll. Oh. Grandma old, gnoll. Old female gnoll. It's a groll. A grandma gnoll. Shut up. Is there any doors in the room? Um, yes. If to the throne's left-hand side, oh, there is a door and on that wall, and then to the left of her, there's a hallway. 
is um, um before her you hear chittering and like clicking noises as you see dog like creatures gnawing on bones noisily. Before her you see five hyenas. Oh. Ranger them with fire. <coughs> <laughs> <laughs> I'm guessing they're magical, so you can roll dice. Well, they probably get a save. <laughs> Why do we <laughs> they even have animals <laughs> in quest? Let's go! Alright, how many hyenas do I keep? Like, why do they even have animals in these quests? Why oh, have a. You just have one ranger, and he walks forward, and he's just like. What's up? And the animals What's are like, dude, this guy! What's up? I gotta reread that ability. I think I'm reading it wrong or something. <laughs> so, the you walk up, you just go, ah! <coughs> Ranger. And you wink, and the five hyenas step forward, go on their hind legs, go, hey. hey. And then they go back on all fours. Alright, uh, after doing a dab, we, we talk to the hyenas. <laughs> Um, Dabbing hyenas. Um, the old lady uh, is yelling at the hyenas to attack you guys, and seeing as they just dabbed to <laughs> you, uh, very confused. Like uh, she instead takes a sip of, or takes a hit of her pipe, tosses her pipe, and uh, casts a spell on it. And it erupts into flame, which uncovers the whole room. Can I try to convince her to not? <laughs> no, she already did it. I'm gonna step out. I'm gonna say no. Yes, the flames go back into the pipe, <laughs> and her pipe goes back into I the pipe. I intimidate the flames. <laughs> what? The flames waver closer as you failed. <laughs> yeah, that one. <laughs> the flames go into your pipe. <laughs> They so, set your hair on fire. Oh fuck! Wait, I have hair. So she does that, and um, the flames start to engulf the whole room. Riley quickly jumps to that and casts a spell of equal caliber, affect normal flames, which is what she did, and puts it down into a slight candle flame that intensifies. I mean, that's intensely hot, and he puts it out. I do have a fire resistant ring, anyways. So. If we all have a fire. Yeah. Well, I mean, <laughs> so I mean, Riley didn't know that. Yeah. Good job, Riley. I mean, then I thought the animals or the Neanderthals had that though. So yeah. Was, all the like, Neanderthals and all, animals. All of your your entire army. Yeah. Um, yeah my army, but on fire. <laughs> I will. <laughs> fire ranger. I would advise um, not I, to do I that. Don't, is, don't, she, is she evil? Uh, yes. yes. No. Yeah. Like, oh, I okay. Mean, um, evil. bitch, you thought. Okay, oh, uh, I speak to the hyenas. Let's restrain her. Speak to the hyenas. Um, who is this woman? Who is this? Oh, uh, she's the witch doctor. The witch doctor. All the... Meanwhile, I restrain her, uh, I suppose. Alright, roll. Me? Because she's going to get up and whack you then. That one. <laughs> nice! You need better dice. Giant dice are not your thing. You think the giant has giant <laughs> dice, so it's natural. You... You walk up to constrain her, and you totally whiff before you, and she hits you on the head with her cl uh, stick, walking Ooh, stick thing. Her, she Boom! Bong. Twelve damage. Wow! <laughs> Bong. I got fucked. I asked the hyenas if this woman has done her any, had done them any harm. Uh, no. Uh, they. I mean, she barely feeds us, but other than that, no. Okay. Um, do hyenas do you like this woman? Nah, it can go either way. <laughs> to be honest. Because I was going to ask the hyenas if they wanted to take care of her. Or can I try to um, persuade her in some way? Huh? Can I try to persuade her? You, you just got clocked in the head. You, you can attack her like, now. Wait, we can attack because she attacked us first. I, I, tried, I cut her Achilles. Oh, wow! Okay, like... <laughs> Bitch! <laughs> I mean, roll, 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 anyway, so roll like, the hit. We're all like very cool. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Yeah, so I fucking with dice fucking suck. You need better dice, dude. Because we were all afraid to attack. Bam! Six. <laughs> Me? Yeah, six more. Damn. 
Okay, this is just getting out of hand. Yeah, you guys <laughs> It's, just, it's like, just this old woman's just beating the shit out of I like, I like the fact that he like he went to go and then he tripped and fell for her and she just goes, eh, 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 eh. He takes out his knife, he's like, you bitch, and totally misses, and she's like, ah again. <laughs> okay. This is just this is just an a this is just a trap. Anthony's like, okay, there's a point when we just kill bitches. Yeah. And she's like, ah! Do you think we should help seven? Uh, her armor sure. class is eight. Do I need a ten or higher? I need a, a nine or higher. So no, I missed. No, you missed. Oh wait, I get two, two attacks. Seventeen. Okay, so yeah, that's that that Go ahead and attack. Jared. Okay. Okay. It might not take one. Yeah, it's like ah, uh, for this is just getting obscene. Hold on. Eighteen. You probably. Yeah. Uh, wait. Eight. What do I check again for that? Bases. Oh, that's my take up. We haven't fought in anything yet, so like we're all like forgot how to do this. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. How does Wait, one? How does one fight? stab? Wait. Which end am I supposed to stab with? Puts it on him. Oh, that makes sense. <laughs> oh wait, I forgot to add my die. Like this. Like so this nine. Damage. I'm supposed to add six. Oh wow. Uh yeah. Okay. She's Sorry, still eight, up. Eight plus six. She's still. Up. Okay, I forget how I uh, do this. Hold on. We're sorry, everybody. <laughs> Don't worry. We got this. Hold on. I gotta I look at the old it. sheet. You guys gotta go, because I can't do shit. Yeah, you're currently on the ground. Okay, animals, go. <laughs> hey, hold on. He, uh, you're I got Jared attack. attack. I stabbed. Oh, Jared's still going. Dude, okay. He has so many Fuck. people that can attack. Okay, okay, alright, okay, alright. Roll right. a d8. Okay, got a d8. One, one. plus six. Seven. 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 Dead. Damn it. Dead, okay. okay. Plus one, because... Yeah, that okay. extra elven stuff. Yeah. Uh, so, eight, dead. Okay. There. So, the body just falls on him. It's like, she whacks you in the head one more time. You're just like, this bitch, as blood starts rolling down your face. You see an arrow pin her to her throne. She starts bleeding very badly from it. And when she goes to try to take herself off, you see a sword come through her head and pin her to the wall and then just slowly go out. You see, you look up and you see your elven siblings saving you. Because right, he's right. part elf now. Oh, yeah. <laughs> brethren? Family? Uh, I can't say oh, brethren. Kelvin kin. Okay. I'm sorry, but that was just getting obscene. <laughs> That was just that was just a travesty. Yeah, yeah come my, on. Not my best moment. I mean, the floor is really uneven. You know, it's, it's a, you're bleeding. <laughs> that's that's yeah, boy. It's just we just see blood like you just see blood like streaming down your face. It's like yeah, it really hurt. I'm glad I have 47 HP. <laughs> How much did she take? 18. You're at 29 health. <laughs> That's still more than my overall She health. almost did half your health. Just because you whiffed it twice. Yeah. <laughs> Alright. What have we learned today? Oh, yeah. Don't fight old lady Knowles <laughs> alone. <laughs> Alright. And if so, you're gonna do it, we watch out for the floors. Grab our bearings and patch you up. Does anybody have anything healing? No, you can heal yourself. I can lay so, hands. back to... 36, because that's what your lay on hands, I think, does. Plus right? 11. Uh, what's your level? 3 yeah. plus 6, so 35. Yeah. And that will conclude this one. So thank you for watching. Thank you all for watching. We did, like, nothing. We really did. Oh, I you mean, murdered a lot of you. You murdered yeah. a lot. You got a horse, and you got your ass handed to you by an old. A, gr a groll. A grandma knoll, yeah. Thank you guys for watching. Funny, how, do, how do I go from mass murder to, to getting your ass kicked by an old lady? To ass Not murder. even an old lady fighting you. An old lady sitting on a chair. <laughs> like, like, she gets an armor class of eight because she only gets her armor bonus from her leather armor. You, she didn't even get a dex bonus because she's not up in fighting. She's sitting on a chair. You fell before her and she beat whack, your ass. Whack. She's like, uh 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 uh. Oh my God. Whack. Bitch. <laughs> you go from killing the whole Knoll army in the second layer to going up to the grandma cook and getting your ass kicked. Yeah, she wasn't in. even like, she's a magic user, but then we just like, nope, none of that. 
Thank you for All right. watching. Thank you for watching. Make sure to like, comment, subscribe. Yes. Check the other episodes and the other sagas we've had, seasons, whatever. Follow us on uh, the social media. Yeah, Facebook, Twitter, Instagram. Uh, support our Patreon. And I think that's all I'm it. got. And if you want, we can release art of our characters. Uh, yeah, because yeah. Jared's starting to do that. Yes. So make sure to check all that out. Thank you, guys. We'll catch you next time. Bye.